Hey guys, this is Ryan from 60 Cycle Hunt, the guitar podcast, and I just got this brand new mono case in, and I'm really excited about it. I've been needing a case for a long time. Previously, I've been using a bunch of ratty old gig bags like this. This one's made by Stag. You can see it's starting to fall apart. There's very little padding in here, like that's it. That's the padding that comes in these around the, uh, the edge. Barely in the amount of packing that, you know, like Amazon uses to pack, you know, like stuff that won't break when they ship it to me is that little bit of foam. But this thing, just got it in the other day, like the foam on the outside is easily like an inch and a quarter thick, something like that. Really thick, firm foam on the front and the back this mono case even there's even padding some kind of rough padding in between the outside and the uh, the storage bag and the inside like this thing feels really tough in every little bit of it I'm really impressed just by the feel of it like it kind of crosses the line between being a gig bag and being a hard case in a lot of ways like it's just really robust it's got this neck holder here holds the neck of your guitar for guitars like that sg back there double-sided there's a thing right here that holds it down so that your your headstock is floating in here and not getting bumped around like other gig bags lots of really neat protective fabrics all over this thing and then on the bottom this ridiculous rubber shoe that is just so thick and so tough and you see there's a gap there and there's also I'm not gonna be able to show it to you You can only like feel it when you reach down. There's a hole in the bottom to catch like your strap button So if you did really drop this thing, it's not gonna puncture your strap button and your guitar or mess anything up like that uh, I love gig bags over hard cases just because of Backpack straps is really what it comes down to it means I can carry an amp in one hand and I can carry my pedal board in the other and the guitar on my back and I'm all set. So that was part of my reasoning of getting this thing versus you know just using one of my hard cases, which I have plenty of. There's a lot of guitars coming in these days. But I just like to use gig bags for you know going around and gigging <laughs> and uh, you know moving my guitars around town and whatnot. Even the handle on this thing is stupid beefy. It's really thick. It's got that mono rivet that you find on their on their straps too. The handle on this thing is ridiculous. And it's got all these little like ties that are made out of metal. It's completely ridiculously over designed. I'm really impressed with it. Well, anyways, let's do a test of it. I haven't even taken the labels off yet, but I got a guitar here. Let's do a let's do a little case demo. Got a guitar here, it's a first act, dos, dos, dos. Adam Levine signature guitar. Let's load it in here. And you can see the neck rests firmly. There. I got this guitar for 25 bucks off of Craigslist. This thing's not gonna close all the way because the, the tag's in the way. I haven't pulled the tag out yet. You know what? Right here, let's do it. We're pulling tags. I know I'm gonna keep this thing. All right, so guitar is in there. Time to demo the case. See how tough it really is, huh? Here we go. I'm by the window. What's he gonna do? Bye bye guitar. It bounced. <laughs> All right, let's go downstairs and check it out. My kid was watching all that, so he's got all kinds of crazy ideas now, seeing his dad throw a guitar out the window. All right, we're going downstairs. Let's go check it out. Yeah, there's a guitar in there. And I'll flip this thing around. I'm still filming, so. All right. Let's see how the case fared. It's 
It's got dirt on it. It's got dust on it. See how it looks. It's fine. It's totally fine. There's no new dings on this or anything. The mono case worked. Dropped it out a window. Not bad. All right, so this thing uh, performed beautifully. Had a nice, dropped it directly out the window. Had a nice little bounce. Landed on its back. The car, guitar is in the same shape it was when I dropped it. No dings or breaks or anything. Perfectly out of tune the way it was before. <laughs> the, uh, the dos 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 survives to play another day. And in the case, no visible scratches or tears or anything. There's some dirt. A little bit of dirt it picked up on that drop, but I mean, it's a brand new case. It's gonna get dirty. I'm really impressed. I was just, the moment I saw this thing bounce, I was impressed. I was like, it bounced like a rubber ball down there. So I feel uh, pretty impressed with that thing. I'm happy with my purchase. Looking forward to throwing it out of more windows. <laughs> I'll probably never do that again. All right, thanks for watching.